Hello everyone, welcome to IMS Gate Academy. In these last moment, are you worried how to maximize your gate score? So here are some easy 4-5 tips for you that will definitely going to help you to maximize your gate score. First of all, my dear students, when you start with the gate examination, just go through all the 65 questions to have some basic idea what is the difficulty level of the question, what are the different things that are asked in the question. This should be done in initial 5-10 minutes. After that, you take up 4-5 easy questions from anywhere. It is not necessary that you start from question number 1. Anywhere you take easy 4-5 questions which sets a tempo for your examination. My dear students, momentum is very important in these 3 hours. If you lose momentum at any point, then even the questions that you know, you find it difficult to solve them. Okay. So, usually what happens is, once a student gets the question paper, he starts solving from question 1 to 65 in sequence. But I will suggest you try the dynamic approach. You pick up questions from between, whichever question you find it easy, solve it first. And then you go to the conceptual questions, then you go to heavy calculative questions. When you do this, you get a lot of confidence for solving the question. Even the highly conceptual question you will get when you have the good tempo while attempting the examination. In this entire test, three varieties of questions are there. Multiple choice question, uh, multiple select question and numerical answer type question. Multiple choice question contains negative marking. So be very, very precise in marking the multiple choice question. Until and unless you are not 100% sure, don't mark. Don't take a guess on these questions because these questions will reduce your marks. The other two varieties, MSQ and NAT, they do not contain negative marking. So, try to solve and attempt all the multiple select question and numerical answer type question because these varieties of question also contains the highest marks. Qual for qualifying gate, multiple choice question is sufficient, but to get a good rank, the candidate has to crack multiple select question and the numerical answer type question. Please remember that numerical answer type question of two marks will consume a lot of time. So, try to go with easy calculations on these varieties of questions. Try to solve them quickly. Try to apply the concept quickly. And don't forget to read all the questions properly. Until and unless you do not read the question properly, you will not able to apply the concept and that will waste a lot of your time. So, while you are reading any question, try to read it thoroughly, try to understand what is asked and then only you proceed. For some questions, if the concept you are not getting clicked, right? If you have read the question but that concept is not clicking you, then what you can do is, you can try to solve that question backwards. Try to see what is asked and with respect to that, whatever data is given to you, try to figure out something from that. This is known as the backward approach and trying this backward approach has helped a lot of students to solve even the highly conceptual questions. Last but not the least, GATE was a long journey of like one year. You almost invested one year of your life in preparing for GATE examination. So, this examination is again a very important examination for these aspirants. So, don't, don't, don't waste your hard work by not rechecking all your calculations. Rechecking all your calculations will definitely help you to improve two or three marks. So you check the silly mistakes, you check, recheck all the calculations that you are doing once you are completing with the examination. So this was a long preparation journey which was filled with up and down. So don't forget to cross check your answers, right? So these are some easy tips that will definitely going to help you to boost your GATE score. I wish you all the best. Do well.